If I'm fixing it, I'm filming it. Well, I'm at a friend's house and uh, it's leaking. His plumbing is leaking. Nothing much serious. But first, let's go turn, turn off the main water and uh, let's investigate. It just seems that the, the saddle is leaking. It looks fairly old. Frank, go get me a screwdriver. We're going to need it for this job. Thanks. Well, this is your normal, typical uh, saddle valve. So what I'm going to do is um, it's just leaking, so we're just going to replace it. it. Usually goes to your humidifier and or your fridge for your water maker. So let's uh, remove those uh, screws, one at the top, one at the bottom, disconnect the line. Well, after I've removed it, I uh, obviously shined up the, the copper so it's nice and shiny, nice and clean. And you can notice that hole there. Um, so we will put in the new um, saddle. But if this was a new hole, you obviously want to make sure the copper is nice and shiny. So again, you shine it up for a brand new saddle before you do pierce. Well, I got the new saddle on, but if you were putting on a brand new one, you would ex just screw it on the top and the bottom and then screw the self piercing valve all the way in and then all the way out. And there you go. It's all ready for your dehumidifier or your ice maker on your fridge. Okay, go back to your main valve and slowly turn on the valve. Very little. Wait till your lines fill up again and then crank it all up. Go back to where you installed your new saddle valve and uh, look for any leaks. Geez, I sure hope this helps. It's a pretty simple fix for anyone. Good luck.